up you guys? It's Katya Books and welcome to another mukbang. I really hope I am pronouncing pronouncing that correctly. Um, these ice creams are already melting so I'm gonna pop them open um, but I felt like doing a mukbang today because I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in a while like all my videos are more informational recipes all that kind of stuff um, and so there's like been a lot going on and I know people more like cheat days but this gives me an opportunity to sit down and talk with you guys and update on life because also there's like a reason why I'm not doing a cheat day and doing a mukbang instead. And I'm having this ginger root beer zevia. And so these are the Wink frozen uh, desserts. This one is cinnamon bun and cocoa dough. It's like cookie dough. Um, I haven't tried these flavors. If you saw my last what I ate in a day, I did have the birthday cake, which was so good. Oh my gosh, there's so much condensation. Mm. So yeah, these are like the Arctic, vegan Arctic Zero kind of thing. Ooh, it's got that cinnamon. Mm. That's really good. Let's see. Ooh. Let's see, it looks like that. Wait, I totally could fit like an entire Halo top and do that, but I wanted like two pints to eat a lot. So we've got these today, and let me just crack open this. I warn you, I may be burping because of this, so if you don't like burping, I'm sorry, but I don't know how much of this like video will edit really. Mm, mm hmm. So yeah, cinnamon bun, let's try that. Mmm. 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 Oh, it's really good. I love the cake um, batter one though that I had. Should have gotten that one too. We only had three flavors at the store today. Cake batter and these two. So I was like, I haven't tried these two. So thought I would do these ones for the mukbang. Mmm. Mmm. But yeah, the reason I haven't done like a cheat day in a while, honestly, is because I mean, although my weight is low, it's been up a little more than where I was. We, my coach and I, have been trying to maintain it. Um, I know it definitely has to do with a lot of stress and stuff that's gone on lately. So I just wanted to kind of like open up with you guys about that. Um. Hmm share my life with you guys, you know, um, that's why I created this channel, so, hmm, but yeah, like, because recently I did lose my job, downsizing, no fun, but it's whatever, but rapidly I actually just got a new job, um, but during that time of, like, when I didn't have a job, like, it was great in that, <laughs> I could sleep in and it was wonderful. Um, but then, I'll be honest with you guys, like, I got kind of lonely. And where I, I realized, like, one of my good girlfriends, like, she tends to be, like, really busy. She's a boyfriend, kind of does her own, like, entrepreneur y thing. So, personally trained, so I kind of like, mmm. And yeah, my depression have not been great. Even though I'm like study, medication, whatever, and I know that's a lot to admit to you guys, but I know mental health is an important talk topic to talk about because so many people struggle with it, you know? And I want to be open with you guys and like hopefully reach out to someone who's struggling and, you know, help you out because trust me, like. I know what it's like to have suicidal thoughts and stuff, um, and it's like really hard to like admit that, especially, it's like, I don't even tell my parents yet, I'm telling the entire universe, go away fly, go away, go away, sorry, but um, mmm, this is really good, let me try the cocoa, mmm, oh yes, mmm, it's more of a coffee flavor, but I'm loving it. Oh, this is really good. <gasps> mm. But yeah. Mental health is like definitely an important topic. 
and something that I've really though had to deal with a long time so I just hope to be like a good advocate for it because trust me I I know what the deepest downs feel like like I obviously don't show that really in my videos and that's what I like about doing mukbang style things so that I can talk and be real with you guys um but it's hard because like even this tattoo even though it means like to persevere through those tough trials that we were put through and that we're not put through things that more than we can handle you know there's a crazy truth to think of but sometimes even this is just like like I'm so grateful for this and this is really what gets me through a lot of the crap that I've had to deal with but I've had like the deepest low where I, like it was it has been since like middle school but it was just like loneliness there's so many feelings um luckily you know I reached out to like this uh, this this girl I knew um, like she was more of like an acquaintance at the time, but now it's like I can consider her a friend. She like I turned to her and she was like, "Yes, we can meet up." And I've spoke to her honestly, and it was just amazing. Like what a godsend that she was able to speak to me and what I needed to hear. And so it was just like, oh my gosh, like, thank you, Jesus, kind of thing. Um. Mm. So good. Oh my gosh. Yes, they fit my macros. Um, but yeah, and so since I had been dealing with all this stress and these external things, I did get a new job. Woo! So hopefully I'll be able to keep up with the YouTube videos. I love you guys so much. So, um, and actually accounting position. Oh my gosh. For my degree, which makes me so happy. So I'm like, finally, I can put something more applicable on my resume. Um, it's a cool engineering company. I won't give any more details regarding name or whatever. But yeah. Um, mm. But yeah. The stress took a toll on my body. And uh, I, I was just more bloated. It was just. And I was more sedentary too. So I wasn't moving around as much. Sure I was doing my cardio. But like. I was just like laying in bed or watching TV. Just. Kind of lazy. Like. The only time I'd get up is go to the gym, run a few errands, you know, that was it. But after talking to my friend, I was just like, oh my gosh, so much more hope. And it, it, it's amazing how just taking that gut, like, leap and reaching out to someone that I didn't know very well, but someone who did offer a hand to me, like, when I was, like, in distress. And, you know, taking that with faith, and it's just amazing. Like, so for, for you guys out there who may be struggling you know, depression, suicidal thoughts, like, there's help. And, like, there's people around you who love you. And it's so hard to, when you're in that mindset, you, like, it was scary. Like, I'll tell you how it feels to be, have, like, suicidal thoughts. And I'm going to be bluntly honest. It's like, you will write a list of like, okay, here are the people kind of like, I would hope to go to my, like, I was literally thinking like, who would I invite to my funeral? I know this is so dark, getting so dark, but I'm being like, I'm hoping to, you know, to kind of explain to others who may not have experienced the subtle thoughts. Mm. So bubbly. But yeah, so who hasn't like experienced that, what it's like, and it's just like, you write a mental list of like, who would I have to go to my funeral? And you have like, you end up making a long list, but you don't see it as, wow, look at all these people who love me. When you're in this mindset of nobody cares, you know, if I was gone, it wouldn't really matter. When it's like, oh my gosh. And that, you know, at first I didn't see it like that. And you're just like blinded. Even though you're, excuse me, making that list and it's just crazy. And so it's like to people out there who are struggling, it's like, People freaking love you. Like, there is someone. Um, my friend, she described it as like, we have a support system. We're a cup. Like this. And the tables are like, you know, the support systems. And the cup may move around. Those things move around. But we always have someone there. There is always someone there. And it's crazy. And the crazy thing is, guess what? You're also like a freaking table for someone else's cup. That's what was mind-blowing to me. Like, there are people who, like, wow, really love you and care about you. Um, 
yeah, it's just, it's just amazes me that I came to that low when, like, I thought I had progressed so much in my mental health. But then also, it was such a low or low that I've ever, like, reached, if that makes sense, that because I've matured so much, I was able to get out of it. And it, it took a while, and it was really hard. Like, it was really hard on me, and it was, like, awful because I feel like then the last few videos, like, I just put it on a fake smile and quickly like, hey, let's make this video, like, you know, but that when I really open up my eyes, I see, I do have friends around me, you know, at the gym, I have people I can look to and say hi to, I feel so great, like, to know I can walk in the gym and, like, maybe not every single day I'll see someone I recognize, but there's always, like, tends to be someone there that, I, you know, I can have a quick conversation with, and that feels really good to, like, Oh wow, I do know people and people care about me being that they, they want to walk up and talk to me and have a conversation. Not too long, of course, because it's a gym and we're working out, but <laughs> I hope that makes sense to you guys. Mm. This week stuff, so good. So good. Mm. Mm. I had to buy one get one free coupon, so I was like, hell yeah. We're gonna do two pints. Mm. And I have a sweet tooth like no other, so. Uh -huh. I really wanted to try their vanilla, but they didn't have it. And they got like a root beer float with the Zevia. Mm. That would be so good. But, like, yeah, even though they're not like super, cr like, creamy, like Halo Top, they're, st I don't know, they're still sweet enough. That hits the spot. Mm. But. I don't know. Maybe next time I'll fit like two halo tops or something. I don't know why it automatically stopped recording. Dumb camera. Don't do that to me. But I caught it because I have the little viewfinder right there. Mmm. Oh man. Yeah. Gotta have more of the cinnamon. Mmm. So I hope like, you can see it all. I don't know if I went to put it like on, like pour it out in a bowl and then like put toppings on it, but I was just too much in a hurry and hungry. Post gym, which making a new video, working on a video talking about different style of training that's towards bodybuilding. That stay tuned, you guys, because it's gonna make a world of a difference in your training. It's already made such a difference for me, and I let me just be implementing it and doing my research. It's like, I met this gentleman at the gym, older guy, um, and because he was, he, like, I could tell he wasn't, like, a bodybuilder, but he was very strong, huge, but he was training with a guy who competes in bodybuilding, like, training the guy and talking him through the science of it. I'm like, if another guy, like, a huge, this guy was huge, too, the one who was training with this guy and um he was just speaking about like i was listening to him i'm like i know bs when i hear bs but i was like no that's all real stuff and like science based everything like this guy knew his stuff and he works like in like construction or something like that so i'm like this guy knows his stuff and so i talked to him and met him and now i try to meet up with him at the gym because he's implementing all these exercises that you may not have seen before, but they have such a purpose that they're like old school bodybuilding, like old school workout. So they're pretty dope. Um, so I can't wait to make that video. That'll be really, really cool. Um, really helpful for anybody who's training for like bodybuilding and size. Mm. I just still have to. I'm just still digging up. A lot of research. Same with the testosterone um, video, testosterone boosters, and all those ingredients. Like I, it, that, it just takes a lot of preparation. Um, those videos, because I want to present you guys with like the right facts, you know. No BS. Not like people. Not like when I was working at GNC, the things they taught me. Mm -mm. I do my research. Mm hmm. Mmm, I'm eating this so quickly, I feel like. I'm, like, trying to savor it, but it's so good. Mmm. Mmm, I'm melting. 
so I kind of have to like eat it quickly. These wink desserts are so good. I haven't seen the other flavors in a while because I remember a while back I had like peanut butter jelly and this other one. I haven't seen those ones. Oh. So wink if you want to uh, sponsor me. I will like do a challenge or something. Aww. We ran out. No. Oh, we have a little bit left. Mmm. But I'm also addicted to Zevia's. Two favorite flavors. Ginger root beer and their cream soda. So good. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh man. Oh man. Mm. Do you guys enjoy these mukbangs? I mean, I know people really like cheat day videos and stuff like that, but because I'm just trying to balance like my cortisol, my stress hormone, and all that kind of stuff, I'm not gonna quite implement those again for a while until I'm back to normal. Um, Excuse me, you see like the burps come because this is so bubbly, like, ooh, excuse me. But, um, yeah, so, and if there's any kind of fun foods, you want to see me eat, I can do that too, maybe, I don't know. Or a topic you want me to talk about, comment that below. Oh, and if you're new to my channel, sub, subscribe for more stuff because... I got a lot coming for you. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That's so sad. I want more. Like, so much more right now. I'm honestly gonna go downstairs and probably eat like a salad or something. Mm. What's something warm? I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. Oh. We're both like gone. Oh man, you guys! Oh, cocoa dough and cinnamon bun. So delicious! So delicious! I really recommend these if you can find them. They, yeah, you have to go on their website and do like the little store finder because there's only one store nearby me that has it. So, all right, my friends. I hope you enjoyed this mukbang, and hopefully, what I had to say regarding depression all that has helped you out. Otherwise, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for more other stuff. Comment below what else you want to see from me or talk about. I don't know. But I love you guys. You are wonderful. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.